Feeling much more like the middle of December, close to Christmas time out there today. And even as we get into tonight, if you're heading out to maybe see some of those Christmas lights, getting a good view from our Toyota field camera, it is going to feel nice out there. Chilly, however, and that is because some of that cloud coverage that we were seeing even later in the afternoon has gone away, seeing a few clouds as we look over Gunnersville from our Way 31 at Sky Camera Network, sponsored by Thompson Roofing. And then look, clear sky. So if you're heading out to those lights, going to get a good view. At Toyota Field, 38 degrees and clear skies indicator, 43 degrees right now in the shoal. So here's what we're looking because we are going to kind of deal with a little bit of a temperature roller coaster going into this Christmas week. So chilly mornings, they're going to return, going to start as soon as tomorrow, more seasonable once we get into the afternoon. And what are you thinking for Christmas Day? Are you going to think the heavy coats or the short sleeves? We'll talk about all of that there in a second. Right now, we're looking at a clear picture over all three of our radar sites from our Way 31 at Storm Tracker Early Warning Radar Network. Not going to see much activity on here for your Christmas week. So that is some good news. Not expecting much of any rain. And again, if you're heading out trying to get in that Christmas spirit to some of those holiday festivities, going to want to bring that heavy jacket and some of those gloves because again, with those clear skies comes a cooling down. But you'll notice as we get into late tonight that look at this. This is a clear picture here on future radar. Once we get into the overnight hours, we're going to start to see that that cloud coverage pushes back in. Now, why is this important? It's because it's going to make a difference when heading out the door on your Monday. That cloud coverage is going to make many of us above freezing, which means that we may not even need the ice scraper heading out the door tomorrow. Topping off in the lower 50s, could see some areas get around mid 50s with that cloud coverage mixed with some of that sunshine. And it's not only tomorrow that we may be eliminated from getting those ice scrapers out because of that cloud coverage on Monday may not need it for your Tuesday morning as well. Temperatures do cool back down going into Wednesday and Thursday morning. So going to want to keep them nearby. Going to need the heavy coats for most of the week. But the good news is that even with that frost, we're not expecting it to impact any road conditions. So if you are heading out for some of those Christmas travel plans, you got the green lights all the way around for all week long. Going to see cloud coverage Monday, Tuesday again, but the sunshine returns plentiful by your Wednesday. And as we go in to your Christmas day, having some high pressure move in. So it's going to bring our temperatures from mild just around seasonable to look what we're going to deal with on Christmas Eve near 70 on your Christmas day as well. So maybe we don't want to bring the coats for your Christmas day. It's going to be one of those short sleeve kind of Christmases. 55 degrees there for our high on Wednesday, close to 60 on Thursday. And then again, going to be not a snow white Christmas, but a warm one.